Hello techies. In this tutorial, we will learn how to schedule desktop flows by using Power Automate. To schedule our desktop flows, we required Microsoft account or personal account or worker school account with upgraded premium account. Without upgrading to premium account, it is not possible to schedule these desktop flows. All right, but scheduled cloud flows and scheduled desktop flows are totally different. Don't get confused about that. All right, now I'm having a small use case over here. I want to post the content or job in LinkedIn groups by using Power Automate desktop flows. If you see on my screen, I have logged in into Power Automate desktop where I'm having the desktop flows as LinkedIn, another one test flow, which I have created. Now let me open the LinkedIn flow. If you see the LinkedIn flow, first of all, I'm going to open an Excel and I'm going to get the, all the groups of the LinkedIn group. And then I'm going to read that by using read from Excel worksheet. Once I read the data from the Excel worksheet, I'm going to launch Google Chrome by using launch new Chrome action and it will redirect to HTTPS www.linkedin.com slash groups. And then once it has been opened, it is going through the loop and then it is going to the particular group by using go to web page action. And then by using send keys, it will post the job or the content in the particular group of the LinkedIn by using this flow. Once it has been completed, it will close the browser and then it will complete the entire LinkedIn flow by using this desktop flow. But over here, I have created a desktop flow. Now I want to schedule this flow on daily basis. But if you observe inside the Power Automate desktop, if you go for the all the menus over here, if you see file, edit or debug, tools, view and if you go for the all the options i don't find scheduling the power automate desktop flow then in that case how can i go ahead and schedule it before that let me run the flow to know how it is going to be working up all right let me click on run flow execution started and it is trying to launch an excel and it is it will tries to read the data from the excel by using read from excel worksheet once it has been done it will launch a new Chrome by using launch new Chrome action. And you can see over here, it is trying to launch the URL that is linkedin.com slash groups. If you see over here, I'm having n number of groups in my LinkedIn so that it will try to open the groups that is linkedin.com slash groups slash 13870539. It's by using go to web page action. Now, once it has been done, it will try to create a post in this particular group by using send keys action. Now, if you see, it is trying to create a post. And if you see over here, it has posted the content inside the post by using send keys action. Now, the next action is that it will click on the post button over here. Now, it is going for the next group that is linkedin.com slash groups slash 46 952 it is another group which is it is with the name accenture and the same content over here it is trying to post in the multiple groups by using this flows action once the post has completed in all the groups it will close the browser by using close web browser action this is all about the linkedin flow over here by using power automate desktop but i need to schedule this post on daily basis. How can we go ahead and do that? But if you observe, I don't have an option over here in the Power Automate desktop to schedule the desktop flows. In that case, how can we go ahead and do that? Let's switch to browser and I'm going to give the URL as flow.microsoft.com and I'm going to log in into the Power Automate by using my organization account or with the upgraded premium account. There, if you see, I'm having my flows over here. Let's click on that. If you go for the desktop flows over here, I can see the desktop flows which I have created. Now, if you see, I'm having 
LinkedIn desktop flow, another one test desktop flow. These are two or desktop flows which I have created by using my premium account. Now I need to schedule this LinkedIn desktop flow. How can I go ahead and do that? This is possible only with the upgraded premium account. For that, first of all, I need to create a new flow that is cloud flow I need to create. Let's drop down that and there I'm going to select scheduled cloud flow. Select that and I'm going to give it as LinkedIn jobs. I'm just going to give the name over here as LinkedIn jobs. I'm going to select this run this flow starting from today at the time of 10 a.m. and it has to repeat once in every day. I'm going to select on daily basis, All right? You can see this flow runs every day and then I'm going to click on create. Now, this is the re recurrence so that I'm going to add a new step over here where I need to call the desktop flows, all right? Here, I'm going to select desktop flows. This feature only available if you have upgraded to premium account. There you can see, run a flow built with Power Automate desktop. You can see over here as premium. And you are having three options over here. One is Power Automate desktop, another one Selenium IDE, another one Windows Recorder V1, which is legacy one. These three actions is available with the premium accounts only, right? Now, I want to schedule the Power Automate desktop flows. In that case, I'm going to select this option over here as, or the action over here as, run a flow built with Power Automate desktop. Now, once it has been selected, you can see over here, desktop flows, you need to select an option or select an item. Over here, what is an item? I'm going to select LinkedIn. And the run mode over here, I am going to select it attended or unattended. I will select attended. This means runs when you are signed in. But over here, if you observe, I need to give the credentials over here. Now, how I have provided, it has been taken already with my credentials so that I need to change it over here. If you click over here on the three dots over here, and if you're going to select add new connection, now over here, if you see, I'm having connect. How I'm going to connect to my Power Automate desktop? There are two ways. One is on-premise data gateway, another one directly to machine. So I'm going to use this laptop or this desktop as my machine so that I don't require any kind of on-premise data gateway. I will explain you about this in the upcoming tutorials. Right now, I'm going to directly go into the machine. I'm going to select that. And after that, I'm going to give the name that is machine or machine group. I'm going to select it as the particular desktop, which I have. All right, this is my desktop. Then the domain and the username. How can we go ahead and get the domain and the username? Over here, I'm going to open the run and I'm going to give you the command as CMD and then click on OK. Now you will get this kind of pop-up. So I need to know the domain and the username. For that, I'm going to use who I am, I is the command which I'm going to give it. And then click on enter. There you can see, I will get the domain and the username. I'm going to copy this. And then I'm going to give the same thing over here in the domain and username. And I'm going to give the respective password of the particular domain. And then I'm going to click on create. Now, the connectivity between the desktop flow and the system has been connected successfully so that you can use the desktop flows over here. You can get all the flows which have been created in the Power Automate desktop by using your premium account, all right? Now I'm going to select LinkedIn is my desktop flow and the run mode I have selected attended or unattended based on the requirement I'm going to select attended over here. Now our flow is ready. Now let's click on save. Now the flow has been saved successfully. Now this flow is executing successfully or not. Now I'm going to test it by clicking on test and I'm going to select the option manually over here and then I'm going to click on test. Then this flow uses desktop flows. To run this flow, I'm going to click on run flow and the flow run successfully started. To monitor this one, we need to go to the page that is flow runs page. Click on that. Now, if you see over here, we have started time around 42 seconds ago and the duration is 40, 42 seconds and the status is running. 
Now, if you observe over here, what are the steps we have done it by using our Power Automate desktop flow that is LinkedIn desktop flow. It is trying to perform the same actions, right? If you see right now, it is trying to open LinkedIn.com slash groups and then it will open the groups and then what it will do? It will post the data which we have given in the send keys. It will post the same kind of content in the particular groups and then it will do the repetitive process based on the scheduling. Now, if you observe, it has posted the data inside the LinkedIn groups by using LinkedIn jobs cloud flow, which has been scheduled. The same process will be repeated daily once on the given recurrence. And there you can see over here the status. It has been successfully completed and the time taken is four minutes because of we have given the time over here as to post in the multiple groups so that it has taken four minutes of time. Now, if you see the history of the particular flow, if you are going to refresh it, if you see over here, the total duration of the flow execution is four minutes, 24 seconds, and the status you can see as succeeded. All right. I hope you understand how to schedule a desktop flow by using scheduled cloud flows as part of this tutorial. Thank you for watching Power Automate tutorials. If you have any queries related to this concept, please post them in the comment section. I will see you in the next session. Till then, bye-bye. Have a wonderful day.